Hey everybody, this is going to be a short video today, not feeling well, but I'm so committed to making sure that you understand the right way to make sure you have safe water that I wanted to make sure I got this video out. One of the things that is important in the world of water and water safety are boil order alerts. You're going to see these, sometimes will get delivered, you'll see them posted in the news, things like that. <clears throat> there can be multiple reasons why there are boil order alerts or boil order warnings uh, given to a, right, an area. The most common is that there was some kind of water main break, which means that one of the pipes got a hole in it, and they cannot guarantee the safety of the water that's going into that pipe from that location. So they have to repair it, get clean water through it, and then that you can have safe water again. That's the most common. The other kind of time that you're going to see boil water alerts is if something's going on where the water treatment plant is not um, producing the water at the level that it needs to be. And there's an example of this going on at one town where um, they've been getting an E. coli notice. Like, they've been testing in 10, 12 different locations, and they've got one notice that said there was E. coli in the water. So they put out a boil water alert for everybody saying, keep boiling your water till we figure out the E. coli issue. Um, this is an important thing to know. Follow those if you get them. Look for them when they can. They end. Oftentimes, read the instructions that coincide with it. A lot of times, they'll tell you to either flush out your pipes or boil water for X amount of time. Just follow those directions until the boil water, the boil water order is lifted. It doesn't mean that you have bad water production. It doesn't mean that your plant is ineffective. It just means that at that moment, there's something going on. And like I said, more on that often than not, it's something out of their control. It's often a, a broken pipe or broken main or something like that where water is, they can't say what might have gotten into the water. And so to make sure that you're safe, they'll put that out until they can repair it and know that you're getting clean water to your tap. So don't freak out if you ever get a boil water alert. Just make sure you read it closely, you understand what it's saying, you follow the instructions, and keep your eye out for when it gets lifted. Uh, they are Most municipalities are extremely good at doing the informing on both the front and back end of boil order alerts so that you know you're safe. Um, and then, like I said, read them carefully. Some of them, they, you can't shower in the water. Some of them, you can't, uh, can't drink the water. It all depends on what the, they know the problem to be. So just keep that in mind. Be aware. Don't freak out. And just follow what the boil order boil water order or boil water alert says it makes a difference and it'll make you and keep you safe a uh, perfect example of this E. coli thing is this is one of those areas where DW liquid ROS is actually really beneficial we have the ability to have we have a high kill load is what it's called when it comes to E. coli salmonella listeria some of these really bad um, these baddies that could be in water we are really good at making sure that that doesn't exist. So I just want you to be aware of that and let you know that if you find you get a boil water alert, feel free to contact your municipality and let them know about disinfectwater.com and that we might be of assistance to them. I get noticed, I get alerts whenever there is one as well and I reach out to see if I can be of help. I just want people to get healthy water as quickly as possible, as efficiently and as cost effectively as possible. And that's why I even have this company. I want people to have good, safe, healthy water. Um, so enjoy, don't freak out. If you get one, it's okay. Just listen, read, and look for it to start and end so that you know you're safe. You'll be fine. All right. Cheers.